What's up, everyone? Welcome back to another late night. Another dip into a musical. This time, an animated musical. More along the lines of Fantasy Wednesday. Except, we're going to keep it within the epic genre because this is sort of categorized within the rebirth of Disney animated features. We will be watching Aladdin starring uh, the very great Robin Williams. Um, this is one of his own staple, I think, performances in terms of voiceover work. I have heard, you know, that he does a really good genie. And you know, I'm not so sure how we would compare to the 2019 live action version. But I don't know. Let's get straight into it. The The only animated film I really remember as a child was um, George of the Jungle. <laughs> Other than that, I pretty much... It's all first time viewing. Yeah, but other than that, we're going to get straight into this one because, Captain, we are Ego. Ah, salam and good evening to you, worthy friend. Please, please come closer. <laughs> too close. A little too close. There. <laughs> nice breaking the fourth wall. He seems like a good narrator. You have it then. I had to slit a few throats, but I got it. I'm assuming cut a few throats is just a f figure of speech. Bring me the lamp. The rest of the treasure is yours, but the lamp is mine. <laughs> the Cave of Wonders. Wait, why doesn't he go inside himself? So far, it's an interesting blend of 2D and 3D animation. Only one may enter here. One whose worth lies far within. The diamond in the rough. A diamond in the rough. Wait, how can he be a humble thief? Shake the out the diamond in the rough. Wow. D did it just kill that humble thief? Diamond in the rough. Stop! I'll have your hands for a trophy, street rat! Well, how do how does what constitutes as worthy or a diamond in the rough? There probably is more prerequisites to that. Gotta keep it. one jump ahead of the bread line, one swing ahead of the sword. I steal only what I can't afford. That's everything. One jump ahead of the. He, so far, he, even he is evil. He's stealing and he's having fun. Well, he has ease is doing it. <laughs> He, he just took that sword out of him. Could have killed the man. Ah, oh, okay. So he's probably going to give or share some. But it still doesn't justify the means how he got it. <laughs> well, it's good Boo is, you know, following after, you know, his master. It's kind of them. If they'd look closer, would they see a poor boy? Boy, home is a lot of very far away. We'll be rich, live in a palace, and never have any problems at all. I'm assuming that will be the ending. You've only got three more days. Father, I hate being forced into this. If I do marry, I want it to be for love. Jasmine. Okay, so there is a timeline, you know, to the to the next birthday. Three days. We'll see what happens then. That's where the whole adventure will take place. Been in the family for years. It is necessary to find the princess's suitor. Don't worry. Everything. Be fine. Look at that, he even has a hypnotic staff with a snake. Jafar, <laughs> even even the way he's introduced to the, uh, the, the... All right, so just like the doves, she was inspired by the doves or the birds. She wants a taste of freedom. <sighs> 
life's going well, what a diversion. <laughs> Sneaky little couple they are. Sugar dates and pistachios! Would the lady like a necklace? A pretty necklace for a pretty lady. Fresh fish! <laughs> the cr cultural merchants of very specific types of men. <laughs> very specific types of products. Oh, please. If you let me go to the palace, I can get oh. some from the Sultan. Do you know what the penalty is for stealing? <laughs> no! Wait, no. she was just gonna give an apple without paying? <laughs> she, I don't know if she knows whether she has that knowledge of you have to pay for things outside of the palace. Time to go see the doctor. Oh, hello, doctor. Mm. How are you? No, 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 not that one. Come on, Sultan. Uh, she, actually, she actually played along quite fast. I mean, uh... You don't seem to know how dangerous Agrabah can be. Hmm. I'm a fast learner. Well, she definitely is, by golly. <laughs> They're just jumping across buildings with a pogo stick. <laughs> That's better than here. You're always scraping for food and ducking the guards. You're not free to make your own choices. Sometimes you feel so... You're just... Trapped. trapped. The privileged and underprivileged. How could they feel the same? <laughs> trapped. Well, sir, surely there's something they're not, you know, covering. They're after, after me. me! They're, they're after, after you? you? Oh, my father must have sent them to- You trust me? What? Do you trust me? Yes. Don't let them oh, jump. Boy, that's quick. <laughs> they fall under a romantic spell really quickly. Do as I command. Release him. Oh, I would, princess. Except my orders come from Jafar. You'll have to take it up with him. Believe me, I will. If only she used that sort of- Authority with the apple. <laughs> what was his crime? I can't breathe. Jafar! Why, kidnapping the princess, of course. Pop, you can check the <laughs> Boy, <laughs> that poor little birdie, or pigeon, or, or parrot. Boy, is he being abused. I'm a street rat, remember, and there's a law. She's got to marry a prince. Wow. He deserves a prince. Hey, well, imagine if uh, by the end, you know, his own wish to the genie is to make him a prince of sort to somehow make this marriage go through. But it's funny that they have their pickpocketing devices. Uh, one problem. It's out there. We're in here. <laughs> Things aren't always what they seem. Wow. <laughs> Secret passageway. Jafar, Jafar is really pushing for it. He, because he uh, eventually wants to become the sultan, right? Remember, boy, first fetch me the lamp, and then you shall have your reward. Come on, Abu. Well, the you shall have your reward part, kind of naive for Aladdin to think he will ever receive it. Just a handful of this stuff would make me richer than the sultan. <laughs> Abu! Ah, the magic carpet. <laughs> it's quite a bit of personality for just a carpet, an inanimate object. There's a lot of personality, so I would consider that a huge success. A magic carpet? Come on. Come on out. We're not going to hurt you. It's funny how Abu was also able to enter and how he was also considered worthy, I would guess. Him and Aladdin are considered one, or he's the extension of Aladdin. Now you will never again see the light of day! <laughs> oh, just about now, they need to get on the carpet and fly out. Wow, tsunami of lava. <laughs> cool. It's it's like the cave is, you know, self-destructing. You know, who knows if you could re-enter it again. Uh oh. <laughs> Oh, just in the nick of time, except now the cave is gone. It's shut. Oh, my head. We're trapped. That yeah, under a lot of sand. How on earth are they going to get out? Here we go. 
this is quite late of an introduction for a character. Hello, Aladdin. Nice to have you on the show. Can we call you Al? Or maybe just Din? Or how about Lobby? Sounds like, here, boy. Come on, Lobby. Hey, I'll, I, I, I'm not... Sounds like Robin William material, like his comedy material. It's almost like it's fit perfectly for him. I don't think you quite realize what you've got here. So why don't you just ruminate whilst I illuminate the possibilities? Of course, man. This, this genie is perfect for him. Impersonations, comedy, you know, or like super loud personality. It's it's Robin Williams. Never had a what an advertising. <laughs> what a promo, self promo, three wishes. Never had a friend like me. Can't bring people back from the dead. It's not a pretty picture. I don't like doing it. Other than that, you got it. Okay, so you can definitely get them out of here for a start. Did you bring me here and all of a sudden you're walking out on me? I don't think so. Not right now. <laughs> oh boy. The genie so far is the best part. Okay, okay. You marry the princess, all right? And and uh, you then you become the sultan. Yeah, so marry into, you know, a sultan and kill them. If you can't get the genie, Go that route. I never actually wished to get out of the cave. <laughs> you did that on your own. <laughs> well, I feel sheepish. Wow, he just reversed engineer it. Like, <laughs> he could just wonder or say, oh, I don't know if he could do this. And then Genie says, okay, I'll prove it to you. Does not count as a wish. And I kind of wonder whether they wrote around Robin Williams as opposed to they wrote it and then found Robin Williams as an actor. You know, because the material seems to be very suited to him. The only way I get out of this is if my master wishes me out. So, you can guess how often that's happened. Well, I'll do it. I'll set you free. Uh-huh. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be a lying Pinocchio. Well, one of the wishes will be that. Say the magic words. Genie, I wish for you to make me a prince. All right! <laughs> yo, 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 yo. Uh, <laughs> The commentary is perfect. Not enough. <laughs> Still not enough. Oh, let's see. What do you need? What do you need? Hey, a car was not so bad. You look good. He's got the outfit. He's got the elephant. But we're not through yet. Hang on to your turban, kid. We're gonna make you a star. Well, but it's all smoke and mirrors, really, as opposed to officially being a prince. You will order the princess to marry me. I will order the princess. Well, not only does this guy have fake documents, he also has the power of manipulation. Yeah, but hang on a minute. All this, this parade, it's all created from the genie. So how, how was Aladdin giving the coins and how are they picking it up? It's all, you know, make-believe. It's all smoke and mirrors, all projections. I must intercede on Jasmine's behalf. This boy is no different from the others. What makes him think he is well, worthy of the princess? What happens if the princess doesn't like this made-up version of, you know, Aladdin and whether she likes the rat version? I can't believe it. I'm losing to a rug. Genie, I need help. All right, Sparky, here's the deal. If you want to court the little lady, you gotta be... <laughs> nice Jack Nicholson call-out. How do I look? Like a prince. Now, the thing is, that's not him. He can't necessarily fake being a prince. Prince like you. And every other stuffed shirt hey, swaggering wait. peacock I've met. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Mayday, mayday, they have to steer clear of this destruction. I'll go now. No! What? What? How... How are you doing that? It's a magic carpet. It's lovely. <laughs> you're telling me no prince has ever told her. You're right. You know what? I don't think you're wrong. I think it's almost impossible for any kid not to have known this song. I've heard this before. Place for you and me. 
Yeah, seems like the perfect, you know, they have everything ideally set up. Who are you? Tell me the truth. The truth? The truth? Um... Yeah, she knew as soon as he asked, do you trust me? For the first time in my life, things are starting to go right. <laughs> That's exactly when things are gonna go wrong. <laughs> Make sure he's never found. <laughs> well, in this case, can he necessarily make a wish without the genie completely available to him? Al? <gasps> Al! Kid! Snap out of it! Oh, you can't cheat on this one. I can't help you unless you make a wish. Exactly, especially if he's dead. Don't you scare me like that. Genie, I... Uh, I... <laughs> Uh, and again, that was not really Aladdin's wish. I... Father! What's wrong with you? I know what's wrong. <laughs> there. Pretty simple. <laughs> I don't know how Aladdin could see it, but Princess couldn't see it. Aladdin! You've just won the heart of the princess. What are you gonna do next? Well, that's all he wanted to win, I would guess. Not the responsibility of the Sultan. Or the reality of it. Maybe it seemed like a good idea from afar. Jasmine, where are you? <clears throat> Out in the menagerie. Huh? Hurry. I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> Fool the wrong crowd. Now look at them. Be careful what you wish for. <laughs> <laughs> Finders keepers, Apu. Oh, evil genie looks crazy. I wish to be the most powerful sorcerer in the world. Genie, stop! <laughs> this is not wishes. He he completely acknowledges, but uh, he still grants them. And now he has one more. For him to do that, <laughs> boy, did Genie make him the most powerful sorcerer. Not so sure how they're gonna come across this one. Uh, Abu, start digging. <laughs> they're they're in the blizzard, no shoes, no proper clothes, and, and boy, I'm not so sure how they're not freezing. <laughs> Well, he was correct. He would be taking his revenge and stuffing the cookies down. We'll do what I order you to do, slave. Jafar. <laughs> well, if he can't do it, he can't do it. What are you gonna do? Hey, I'm a street rat, remember? <laughs> I'll improvise. Well, Street Red has to get the um, the genie the genie cover or the 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 metal piece and then assume uh, master over him. Stop! Jasmine. Oh, that's a cool visual. She, um, Princess Jasmine, ending up in the hourglass. Cowardly snake! A snake, Emma. Perhaps you'd like to see how snake-like I can be. Okay, now he reminds me of a coup in Samurai Jack. <laughs> the, it, but again, sorcerer, you know, powers kind of works to the favor of the animators. You stay out of this. Jafar, Jafar, he's our man. If he can't do it, great! As Robin Williams comedy, <laughs> in the middle of a fight, you have a cheerleading squad. The genie has more power than you'll ever have. What? He gave you your power. He can take it away. Al, what are you doing? Why are you bringing me into this? <laughs> <laughs> hey, well, both of them can't do anything without the genie. The absolute power! What have you done? Trust me. This guy got way too po big for his own good. Except now he's going to be stuck in a lamp, isn't he? <laughs> Literally everything he wished for got unwished. 
So technically he should be unwished on his genie wish. Jasmine, I do love you, but I gotta stop pretending to be something I'm not. I understand. Yeah, father, father, just help him break the rules. Yeah, that should be his, well, wish. Except he, he, he'll go for the free genie. I'm free! I'm free at last! I'm hitting the road! I'm off to see the world! <laughs> a genie still with powers, but a comedian at the heart of it. From this day forth, the princess shall marry whoever she deems worthy. Well, there you go. Just broke his wish. Yeah, well, broke his law, sorry. No! I'm mythology! No, I don't care what I am! I, well, I say, if there ever is a second film, go go to see what the genie is doing. <laughs> Made you look. Hey, that, that's nice again. Fourth wall breaking. Thoughts. Um, this was a fun, um, fun piece of '90s Disney animation. Not. It wouldn't be considered the top, but still good. Um, I think who makes the film, as as we know, is Robin Williams. He makes it a lot more fun. Um, Jafar, in terms of a villain, is pretty one note. He wants to be the prince, and he'll do anything. The Sultan, I'm sorry. He wants to be the Sultan at any cost possible. Um, the princess just wants to get married with somebody um, decent, um, not forced to to just anybody. Um, Aladdin wants to be a prince and wants to sort of live vicariously in a palace with his, you know, monkey and uh, so on and so forth. Um, but then you have this underlying theme of freedom and how the privileged and the unprivileged and the jailed and the constrained, how everybody is sort of, you know, trying to get out of freedom and buy their way out, wish their way out and so on and so forth. Sort of the, the end, um, the ending is sort of for the more for the princess as she's you know she goes to a whole new world after you know marrying a prince and he himself gets out of this i guess the rat race shall we call it so everybody gets their own wish granted uh, everybody is free at last and yeah but i uh, movie went a lot faster than i expected um there are certain sections that you know could have could I have done with a little bit more exploring. I was actually very curious about the Cave of Wonders. It seemed like a cool um, place to be in and to explore further. Um, but other than that, I think we probably needed more scenes with the genie and Jafar. I think if we had a little bit more of Jafar, it would have been, you know, cool. Can it, he seems, you know, well designed and so on and so forth and his sorcery abilities and the very end with him wanting to be a genie. I think it was sort of short lived in terms of all his own abilities and how psychedelic the imagery could have been um, almost like a Doctor Strange, if you will. And I'm pretty sure the animators could have had a lot of fun with it. But other than that, still, um, um, you know, Disney's, you know, I'm sure. I assume this was one of their hits, right? Um, that song, that music, in terms of theme parks, in terms of merchandise, um, they did really well. And specifically, culturing, uh, capturing a certain culture, and then creating a film after it. Um, I would assume this is more Middle East as opposed to Indian, um, but you guys can correct me on that. Um, yeah, but. Other than that, good picture. It's a nice shakeup in the the whole um, watching catalog. So for what we've watched, it's pretty random. But, you know, um, that's kind of the fun of it. And until I see you in the next episode, um, stay well and go outside and see a whole new world. See you on the next episode, my friend. What's up, you cinephiles? 
Thank you very much for making it to the very end. Me and Big Willie don't take that for granted. We really appreciate you. Now, if you'd like to show your support to us, you know what you can do up here. You can smash that button, really just smash it. And, you know, if you would like to check out some more content, they're all curated by days up over here and playlists. So, you know what? We hope you're having a great day. Don't crumble and just continue to smile and be a good bastion of cinema.